So this is just going to be a quick video on active and passive buzzers. So a lot of kits come with an active buzzer and a passive buzzer. What an active buzzer means is all you have to do is provide a voltage and it provides the tone. So I have this module set for 5 volts to the rail there. When I turn it on you'll hear the buzzer turn on. And now when I remove the paper, the active buzzer usually comes with this paper that says remove seal after washing and when you remove it when you remove it it gets a lot louder of course so it is pretty loud uh, there's a plus sign on the tab there there's also a plus sign on the component right there and of course you can also use a 9 volt battery so note that in both cases the plus side of the component is towards the more positive side of the power source. Now these buzzers come in two types. So this is the active one. This one's a passive one. As I just showed you, all we have to do is apply a voltage to this one and it buzzes on its own. That makes it the active one. The passive buzzers, they need an oscillation to get them to buzz. So that's more complicated than I'm going to do for this video. But uh, you actually need circuitry to create an oscillation for this one to buzz. And this one has the circuitry in it already, the active one. And uh, so the active one also comes with this paper on top that says remove seal after washing. And the passive ones don't seem to ever have that sticker on there. So when they're new, that's one way to tell them apart. Also, the uh, passive ones the ones that you need to add circuitry to make them buzz they're not sealed on the bottom here you can see this little board here where everything is uh, soldered together the the active buzzer is sealed on the bottom so it has circuitry in here to create the oscillations for it to buzz and uh, and then they seal it and uh, of course the positive side they have a polarity. Looks like both of these do. Both of them have a plus side on uh, one side of the buzzer. And so that needs to go more positive. And of course the other side more negative. 